As you are able, please let us stand to sing the Black National Anthem, lift every voice and sing. My name is Bridget uh, Terry Long. I'm very, very proud to be the Dean of HCSC, and it's my pleasure uh, to welcome you to the 2020 Alumni of Color Conference. So I was very delighted to learn um, of this year's theme, HCSC 100 Years in the Making, Past, Present, and Future of Education for Communities of Color. My name is Zoe Mayfield. My name is Marlon Chen. And we are this year's Alumni of Color Conference co-chairs. The annual Alumni of Color Conference was founded to bring awareness to the educational issues that impact communities of color. Over the years, the Alumni of Color Conference has created much needed space for students, educators, alumni, scholars, researchers, and policy makers alike to connect and to discuss educational issues related to students and communities of color. I am here actually to gain more. <laughs> I, need, I need to be fed. So um, as an administrator, as a teacher, I'm giving so much and I really wanted to come to this conference and get fed. Hello everyone. This has been an amazing conference. Every year I'm like, I don't know how we're going to top it. And then I come and I'm like, oh, this is amazing. Um, but in order to make this happen, we need people. Um, and the students who commit their time to this are the ones who make this conference happen. Thanking you all for having us here. I mean, I feel that it's a tremendous honor to be, you know, kind of like the chosen ones who represent all these people that were actually, you know, equally important, if not more important. Just what I heard this week of like, uh, what it means to really live the peace in the time that I got schooling at an early age, which is no history, no self. You know, to be my age and still searching is a testament to why we still need ethnic studies. And it's been extremely, I say, profound to see people here today, 50 years later, that will continue to ask and question this, quote, society of ours, where they do not make each generation feel the way we have all felt from generations before us and on. So it's all on you guys next. <laughs>